The FTSE 100 has plunged after Russian President Vladimir Putin launched a full-scale invasion of Ukraine, plunging Europe's eastern border into war. The blue chip index fell 2.7 percent, and at one point, a barrel of Brent crude was trading at $103. Europe's main markets fell even further than London, with Germany's DAX and the CAC in Paris both down by about 4 percent. Trading on the Moscow Stock Exchange has been suspended until further notice after the main index plunged 30 percent. A senior UK minister has warned that the country's cost of living crisis will become driven by war as gas, petrol and food prices begin to soar in response to the Russian invasion of Ukraine. Tom Tugenholt, chair of the Foreign Affairs Committee, told the BBC Radio 4 programme earlier today that if Europe failed to take a tough stance against Moscow, the cost of petrol will surge beyond £1.70 per litre. Germany's economy minister has assured consumers that the country can guarantee the supply of gas and oil without the aid of Russia. Robert Habeck said he expects prices to continue to rise in the short term following the Kremlin's attack on Ukraine. The announcement follows Chancellor Olaf Scholz's decision to put the approval process of the Nord Stream 2 pipeline on hold. The 11 billion US dollar energy source, which runs beneath the Baltic Sea, would double the volume of gas sent directly from Russia to Germany. Ukraine has closed its airspace to civilian flights, according to a statement released on the Ukraine State Air Traffic Services Enterprise website. The European Union Aviation Safety Agency said airspace in Russia and Belarus within 100 nautical miles of their borders with Ukraine could also pose safety risks. Early morning airline traffic avoided the entire country in crowded corridors to the north and west to avoid being caught up in the ongoing military offensive. Those are your main stories from London at close of business.